already nationally recognized for their unique approach to healing the invisible wounds of war, Homebase has launched a new initiative designed to educate and train first responders to identify and care for post 9-11 veterans. Clearly one of the most important issues in getting people the treatment they need for these invisible wounds of war is to identify those individuals uh, and, uh, and not let them slip through, through the cracks. The trainings titled Serving Those Who Have Served, Practical Approaches to Addressing the Invisible Wounds of War in Post-9-11 Service Members and Veterans consist of a series of videos featuring local veterans who share their experiences regarding the challenges they faced resulting from their invisible wounds. I was never scared when I thought I was going to die on the operating table, but I said the scariest moment in my entire deployment was coming home. It's not to be forgotten that it is those moments in time that are opportunities to really make a difference. We heard sometimes people feeling, well, you know, I'll never learn how to treat post-traumatic stress disorder and traumatic brain injury. I won't have the opportunity to make a difference, but you do have an opportunity to make a difference. I wasn't even thinking straight, and I decided to, I said, you know what, today's the day. I'm not going to live anymore. Made possible through a $1 million grant from the Massachusetts Attorney General's Office, the trainings are available online, on demand. They each run under an hour and are accessible to all who could benefit from learning to recognize the signs of post-traumatic stress, traumatic brain injury, and substance abuse. The trainings also help first responders identify suicide risk and understand how military culture impacts care. Now more than ever, we need to make sure that our first responders, our nurses and allied health professionals who are on the front lines day in and day out, working with veterans and military families are able to uh, best recognize the signs of these issues and then help folks overcome these barriers to accessing care. And this is what I love about Mass General Hospital and the Home Base Program, that we are addressing these challenges early on. The motto at home base is, their mission is complete, ours has just begun. These first responder trainings expand home base's existing educational programming, programming that has already reached more than 45,000 clinicians, educators, and community members nationwide.